Royal Society of Chemistry is the professional body for chemists in this country and is concerned with professional standards and also with the training of chemists and it validates all uh, degrees in chemistry throughout the country. Um, the education department is concerned obviously amongst other things with the teaching of chemistry in schools. Now we have a particular problem at the moment which is that science at GCSE is taught as science rather than the individual science subjects, physics, chemistry and biology. And many of the science graduates who are teaching science are not, do not have a background in chemistry, although they may have done chemistry at school. So we are now running these courses, which are called Chemistry for Non-Specialists, to raise the level of um, knowledge and professional ability in running practicals and demonstrations within the classroom. And we had a lot of fun today, obviously, um, showing teachers how to carry out experiments in the lab, how to do exciting demonstrations, how to place those in context within the curriculum. We asked to do the course at the Kent Science Resource Centre here at the Kent Science Park because the laboratories are really good and we have excellent facilities here. It enables us to do the experiments in the ideal situation.